Hey, hey, what's going on, y'all? Sam with Slam here. Welcome back to another Slam Boo Review. Um, and I just got back from the theater, and uh, I took my son to go see uh, Sonic the Hedgehog with my girlfriend, Kaylin. And we got to see it. I forgot it came, it came out. It was coming out this weekend. Um, but I, I said, you know, I bought me some stuff, you know, and I'm poor, but, you know, even when you're poor, you got to do what you got to do. And I took my son to go see it. This is our second movie together. We saw Dumbo the first time, our first movie, taking my son. And this is the second movie. And, um, I mean, this is a review. This is a, this is a, what I can say is, this is taking my son to a movie for him to watch. And I'm watching it with him. This film is made, this film is made for him. For kids, indeed. Yes, Jim Carrey is Dr. Robotic. Um, ben Schwartz played uh, Sonic the Hedgehog's voice. Um, James Martin plays the sheriff. It's like he's playing like Garfield and Oli. Whatever the heck Garfield and Oli's. Max or Max, I forgot. Like the man playing, uh, portraying him in some kind of way because Sonic never had this. I mean, did he? Did he have a human friend? Or is this because is this of the movie? It's a live-action film, and I forgot his girlfriend, his wife's name, which, it, I mean, but it was okay. I felt bad for the, well, it's Hollywood. It was like a 90, 90 million movie, or whatever it was. It only made 21 million. Ugh. And at the very end, there's gonna, there might be a sequel. Hope there is a sequel still here. Take my son too, but you know, for this, just for the story alone, you find out that Sonic is from another planet. And he gets those gold rings. And he can try, when he gets caught, he has to go to this world and this world. No one can take his power. Then he reaches in America, and he he, he reaches America, and then. He, he sees he's a very lonely person. He sees people, and that's why he, he calls James Morrison's character the sheriff or the, the deputy, Donut Lord, because he, or, because he has a, the he eating donuts. He's a pig. He's a cop. But the thing is, though, this is just not. Well, go poop then. Sorry, my son. Well, come down there. Here it is, the bathroom. Yeah. You want, bring your tablet so you have a poop reader. <laughs> I'm going to go poop first. I'm going to go poop first. No. <laughs> my son, you got to go poop. This, but the thing is, the other story, just, okay, before I spoil it, I mean, like I just said, he comes from one planet, that's why he's in these rings, and then he gets caught in America. Okay, for the story and stuff, I mean, it's very simple. But then again, unforgettable story. I mean, just, oh, the the hedgehog fight. I mean, I'm going to spoil it. Not yet. I mean, just an unforgettable story. For my son's case, he loved it. I mean, for a kid, yeah, I would love it too. And that's the thing I would like to talk about too. Is people would say, you know, I'm a big pro wrestling fan. And people would be like, why don't you grow, you, don't you grow, that, grow out of it, you know? That shit's fake and soap opera. I don't give a damn. I, I love pro wrestling. I've been watching pro wrestling since I was at, well, I thought it when I was like two or one, but actually my mom told me that I was, I, my dad used to watch the WCW Saturday night, and I'd be, I would stream my soul watching the, the, the screen. Wrestling's always been there um, for me. It's always been an outlet. It's always been a, to escape from reality, just, just, I don't know. And, uh, something that I can tell you I grew out of animated films. Now, there's some films that I can get into. I mean, what, Brave Little Toaster, that was a classic. I want to check out The Page Master. I've never seen that movie before, and I want to check it out. So, yeah, be on the lookout for that. I definitely want to check out that movie. Um, but I don't know when I'm going to be able to watch those films yet. I just, well, here's the thing, too, because uh, this is my last... Oh, well, shut the door, then. I don't care. I'm down here. But, um, the movie, I mean, I use this app, and I get paid five, I mean, I canceled it, and, but I'm gonna get it back later, it's my thumbnail maker, well, I get the play pass, it's only five bucks a month, but at the same time is, I'm taking it out real quick, 
and I'm going to get it back later on the month because that's the only way I can get the thumbnail maker. Now, the movie, I do I do have this movie editor, which I do when I can play all of my files together. I mean, I could get a free power director with the power director watermark, but be on the lookout for more movies for that. I'm going to be I'm gonna be doing that shortly. But this is the last movie for a minute. I mean, well, I mean, it's just, I can watch any kind of movie. It's just a thumbnail maker. I'm going to wait until I have the thumbnail maker on. So, yeah, but it's worth $5. I mean, it's I can't find any other thumbnail maker that's good as theirs, and every other ones are slow. But back to the movie. Very unforgettable. You know what? Jim Carrey is the villain. It's Dr. Robotic. It's okay. It's just, he's all right. I prefer Jim Carrey in other films. Ace Ventura. I mean, Dumb and Dumber. I mean, Bruce Almighty. Some of the, I mean, I love his films. Him, I, 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 I never like seeing him as a villain, but he's playing a, a legendary car- a video game character, Dr. Robotic. And he has the straight hair, and then at the very end, you know. But yeah, don't worry. I, I, you know, and then James Marsden's character. It's, and then these weird stories. They have to, I don't know. Didn't really care. So, but it's only, I, I'm only going to get this movie a thumbs up for my son's sake. Yeah, I'm only going to get this movie a thumbs up for my son's sake. Now, I'm gonna, I'll tell you, I mean, it's just not a movie for me. It's a one and done for me. I don't care, but it's just the only thing that matters is taking my son to a film, to an animated film. He has, the, I mean, he was all, I mean, next time I'm getting popcorn too. We didn't get popcorn. We cheated. We, we had Capri Suns in our pockets. We had, I had my Fago Red Pop, and we had cheese sticks. So the next time I will buy some popcorn. And also, too, when sit in the theater, I want to sit in the left. I mean, I hate being in the. I don't care if people run by me. I don't care. But for me, I just I get very. I just my social. I just want to be. I don't want to bother people. So next time I watch a movie with him, instead, I'm gonna sit all the way in the. We're gonna sit all the way in the left side. I don't really care. It ain't gonna hurt me. I realize I don't really give a damn. If I like see the movie with him, I don't really care. But yeah. One and done for me. Recommended for an eight-year-old. Recommended for the kids. I mean, yeah. But yeah, that's what it is. I, re- I really recommend it for the kids. Not rewatchable for me, but maybe rewatchable for my my son. But yeah. But the spoilers. The story is is basically Sonic. He's he, this. I forgot the owl that was taking care of him. It's like, oh, you gotta have power, and if you get caught, you. Uh, there's these rings that you can go to this universe, this universe. I'm saying I must put my sons in that. You can't hear my son. But yeah, it's just, I didn't, I mean, and then he gets in San Francisco, you see a little story development. Then you see Jarms and Madison. James Morrison's character, I mean, I'm not really a fan of his work. I mean, I'll do respect, it's just my opinion. He's okay. Wasn't he an enchanted, I think, or something? Hell, I don't know, but. It's an evil... Like, he had a bit... Because he turned to Ultimate Sonic, Mega Sonic, Super Sonic... I don't know. He 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 had one big blast nut, Sonic did. He blew up the whole fucking world, supposedly. Like, the surge, and then that's how they get, the government gets Dr. Robotic. And he's and that's Jim Carrey and stuff. His, you know, his parts in this is okay, but he's a dick. Why, why are villains are such an assholes to their... They're always... They're the villains, but they've they got these followers, and... These fo- and every villain has their followers, and they treat the followers like shit. Like there's this smart Alec that's just and he can just he oh he's there you know dude. So I don't give a fuck about you, you know. I don't know, but I it's just a family flick, and like I said, family flicks and auto and animation films, this whatever mixed with not. I don't really care. I get very lost focused. I'm more into the radar film. Sorry, I like seeing titties and ass. And yes, th- well, this ain't gr- this ain't directed towards children. Sorry, this reviews on my reviews, but I'm cussing or whatever. But I'm more of a radar motherfucker. I P- certain PG-13 films. There's some fil- family films that can work, like Little Brave Toaster. I can rewatch that again. Like I said, I'm a, I'm gonna be watching Page Master soon. I'm more into the horror movies, but that's just my that's just my opinion. So, but yeah, I'm going to get the hell out of here, though. Uh, Sonic the Hedgehog, I only give it a thumbs up for my son's sake, but it's not rewatchable, and I would recommend it for the children. So, but thank you again for watching this video, and we'll see you.
the next flick. Peace.